Hi everyone, my name is Anand. This is the part two of India Big's problems on time solution solutions. If you didn't watch the first part, the link will be given in the description. Please check it. A train 240 meters long passes a pole in 24 seconds. One train is there 240 meters length. It passes the pole in 24 seconds. So formula is distance equal to speed into time 240 equals to speed is we don't know into 24 s is equal to 10 meter per second how long will it take to pass a platform of 650 meters 240 meters 650 meters its speed is 10 meter per second so again now distance is 240 plus 650 890 is equal to 10 into time t equals to 89 seconds so option B. Next problem. Two trains of equal length are running on parallel lines in the same direction at 46 kmph and another train is 36 kmph. They both are running in the same direction. The faster train passes the slower train in 36 seconds. This is called 36 seconds. Passes passes means initially the faster train is here, starting is here. After passing, starting of the faster train will be here. So total distance it covers is this length plus that length. Two trains length. So 2L is equal to speed as both the trains are in the same direction moving in the same direction speed is 46 minus 36 that is equal to 10 convert into meter per second into 36 so l is equal to 50 meters option a next problem a train 360 meters long is running at a speed 45 kmph in what time will, will it pass a bridge and the bridge is there 140 meters long how much time it will take t is equal to how much distance is 360 meters plus 140 meters that is equal to 500 equals to 45 kmph is there so convert into meter per second into time so this is 100 Five, 9 table 5 times 2 times 5 table 20 times t is equal to 40 seconds next problem two trains are moving in the opposite direction 60 kmph one is 60 kmph another one is 90 kmph in the opposite direction their lengths are 1.1 kilometer and 0.9 kilometer respectively the time taken by the slower train to cross the faster train in seconds here it should travel the it should cover the two trains distance why because time taken by the slower train to cross the faster train slower train is 60 kmbh Crosses means initially slower train is starting is here like this here after crossing starting will be will come here so total distance covered is this distance 1.1 plus 0.9 that is 2 kilometers 2 kilometer is equal to as both the trains are traveling in opposite direction 60 plus 90 that is equal to 150 kmph into time everything is in this is in kilometer this is in kilometer per hour so we will get time in hours that is equal to 1 by 75 hours we want in seconds so 1 by 75 into 60 minutes into 60 seconds 15 table 5 times 15 table 4 times 5 table 12 times so 12 fours are 48 48 seconds next A jogger running at 9 kmph along the railway track. One jogger is there. He is running at 9 kmph speed. 
along a track in 240 meters ahead of the track ahead of the engine on engine is there the distance with the gap between the engine and the person is 240 meters engine uh, length is 120 meters long running at 45 km each in the same direction this is also in the same direction how much time will will the train pass the jogger distance is equal to speed into time it has to cover 120 meters plus 240 meters to cross this person so that is equal to 360 meters this is in kmph both the uh, both are in the same direction so 45 minus 9 is 36 into 5 by 18 into time we don't know how to calculate this is 2 times 180 this is 36 3 is, 3 is equal to 36 seconds if you like this contents please click on the like button i am going through i am i will do the solution videos for all the prop all the aptitude topics from different websites after that i will create uh, uh, data structures and algorithms coding coding after that i will create videos for the multiple choice questions of c and python languages if you if you think that these videos will be useful for your friends please share to them please subscribe to my channel thank you